Hello, Mark's Remarks here with another video. This time we're going to be looking at the McCoy's chips. They're crinkled chips with full on chip shop flavours. Chip shop curry sauce flavour. They're, they're crisps in the shape of uh, chips. Apparently, they're new. Um, the guy in my local independent corner shop tells me these are less than two months since they were invented or released and uh, they're costing a pound promotional offer I guess it says on the or reads on the back full of chip shop flavors all wrapped up why not try our chip shop salt and vinegar so I didn't see that in the shop when I was there earlier but if I see it I'll get one and I'll I'll do another video okay it's a 70 gram bag and let's go have a look well wow. mm, pretty good uh, pretty good curry flavor it's uh, reads on the back curry sauce flavor reformed potato snack which makes kind of sense because um, well actually there's a lot of broken ones in here. It makes sense because this is what they look like. They're very thin, so it'd be difficult to sort of cut that into that shape. So I guess in reformed means there's a big uh, pulping machine that churns these out and they just cut them to size. But mm, there is a curry flavored uh, smell to them. All right, let's give them a try though. The actual pieces are quite thick. They're not like not thin like crisps that you might be used to. They're very um very thick and crunchy. And they do actually taste like chip shop <laughs> curry sauce. I've actually I've had curry sauce out of chip shops. And these do actually taste like I'm gonna hold this up. They do actually taste like chip shop curry sauce. Which is quite surprising because normally they normally they sort of exaggerate on how how chip shop like the flavour is, you know. But hmm, they've actually done a good job of uh, recreating the sauce, the flavour, curry sauce. Ingredients: dried potatoes, sunflower oil, maize starch, curry sauce flavour, sugar, dried yeast. Yeah, all the usual. Paprika again. Everything's got paprika in it. Christ. There's um. Anyway, but uh, but yeah, like I said, there's, there's a chip shop salt and vinegar flavour, which I'll try and get my hands on. In the meantime, these are actually quite nice. They really do taste like curry flavoured um, uh, there's sauce, you know, that you get in a tub from the chippy. Well, it is in the chippy I've had, thing too. Hmm. Yeah, it's actually quite good. They're very crunchy. I mean, if you, I don't know if you can get a, an idea of that. They're um, three, four times as thick as regular crisps. But being that they've tried to make these look like chips, that's the only way. They, I mean, they, they, they couldn't cut them like this, like they do crisps. They'd have to make these um, out of a, you know, out of a pulp. Bit like the do we brown French fries, I think. Hmm, but doesn't make any difference, they're still good. There's a I'm noticing there's a lot a lot of broken ones in here, which which is not too much of a bummer, it's just that um we've really gotta dive in there and pull out a piece of bis you know, Peter piece of crisp like this, it's a small, it'd be better if they're bigger ones like this, you know, we just dive in there and pull them out. Yeah, I'm very impressed with these. I don't go much on the um, the strong curry flavours, I like a mild one, but this is actually quite mild and it's it's a good flavour. It's not mamby-pamby and, you know, pale, pale flavour, it's actually 
taste like it does, like it says, chip shop flavoured uh, curry sauce. Well, yeah. All right. Well, that's 70 gram pack. They're doing them for a pound because they're, they're within, they're about a couple of months old, the guy told me in the shop. That's what they look like. Okay. Very nice. Thank you for watching and uh, speak to you soon. Bye.